How to keep wasps from coming into my house. Wasps and bees can be a nuisance and a health hazard. About 1% of people are allergic to stings, and around 50 to 100 people die annually from stings, according to information from the Illinois Department of Public Health. Getting rid of these pests can be tricky and potentially dangerous. Things you'll need Heavy clothing Pest spray Pesticide Eliminating pests Educate yourself. Wasps can be visually differentiated from bees because of the shape of their thorax. On a wasp, the front section of abdomen tapers to become a small tube as it attaches to the middle section of the body, according to the Illinois Department of Public Health. It is important to know whether you are dealing with a bee or a wasp because they may require different types of management. Attack at night. Flying pests are less likely to be active at night, so try to remove the nest at night. However, do not carry a light, such as a flashlight, because it might attract the wasps out of the nest directly to the light. Remove the nest. The main factor in eliminating and removing wasps is getting rid of the nest. This may be possible through spraying the nest with aerosol sprays such as those sold at hardware stores. The spray can be used to disable the wasps to enable you to knock down and remove the nest. Protect yourself. Wearing heavy clothing can help protect you from bee stings when you are trying to remove the nest. Cover your hands, neck and all exposed areas to protect yourself. Make sure you get the nest. If you see wasps flying through a vent or hole in the wall, keep in mind that the nest may be a distance away. This may require a professional exterminator to remove the pests. Even if you kill the nest inside a wall, it must still be removed to prevent decay and other pests. Also, do not try to block the entrance to the nest, because the wasps will simply look for another entrance. Prevent the problem. Wasps can be attracted to food. Using containers with tight seals will work to prevent pests from moving in. In addition to putting food away, the Illinois Department of Public Health recommends sealing off areas such as attics that may attract wasps. If the area is sealed tight, the wasps won't move in. Tips Warnings After spraying the nest or applying pesticides, use a broom or other object with a long handle to knock down the nest. This will work to prevent you from getting too close to the wasps. If you are allergic to wasp or bee stings, find someone to help you. According to the Illinois Department of Public Health, those who die from strings usually die within an hour of being stung.